Newport's flower arrangements are known to reach quite heady heights, but this display of grow your own was something entirely new. In council pots, up to 30 illegal cannabis plants, all in pride of place close to the city's high street. Steve Reynolds smelt them before he saw them. It was about a week ago we spotted them and um, walking into work, I'd see um, the council there with their van watering the plants every morning. So uh, the person who planted them also had the, the advantage of the council tending for them as well. So, yeah, quite funny uh, seeing that every day. Yeah. Newport has won the prestigious Wales in Bloom competition seven times. But there are those who want the council to spend less time on the plants and more on growing local business. Dean Bedis managed to take photos of the plants before they disappeared. It's the fact that they were in the Newport Council official plant potters with the, the Newport logo on there and it was like where they were and what they were planted in was the, the funny aspect of it, like, you know, so, yeah, it made us smile. Newport City Council found no sign of them, but added although this could be a hoax, it is a serious issue and they will be informing the police and checking CCTV. The City Council will of course want to show off Newport to its best, so we'll be pleased to see that the plants have finally disappeared. But of course it won't make it easy for police as they try and sniff out this mystery gardener. But whether this is a stunt or not, begonias and petunias will never get the same attention, meaning that more way out means will definitely be needed to make these prize pots stand out in the future. Rhiannon Mills, Sky News in South Wales.